Hello Minecraft and YouTube. Welcome to our little experiment. My name is Preacher KJB. We have we're looking at the idea has has Mojang unintentionally nerfed branch mining in 1.18. We're going to explore that I thought, but first let's look at the effort that was put forth. First thing we have, we have a, a a branch mine. This is a typical branch mine. Now, what I did to try to keep it uh, as basic as I could, uh, in 1.17, we go down to the level right above lava level. So the, the block right above lava level, and we begin to mine. And as you can see, it looks like, hey, look, diamonds. Uh, as you can see, lava level seems to be pretty consistent across the board right here. So we started right at the top of lava level, which is y equals negative 54. So, and then we mined out a 100 by 100 area. We did three high uh, branches with a three by three trunk going down the middle. Okay, and then we skipped, we, we would only skip two blocks and then mine uh, another branch, skip two, mine another branch. And so we did that. Uh, and so we're going to try to keep that there as consistent as possible. So we did mine out this entire area. And so just for, I wanted to look at the effort. And now let's look at the data. How, what kind of, how many diamonds did we find in this 100 by 100 area? Let's drop down and let's look. All right, so in the 100 by 100 area, we found 23 diamond ores. Now those were contained within nine diamond veins. So nine different diamond veins, uh, we found 23 diamond ore. And so that would actually be a, a good amount of diamonds. So let me jump over to the 1.17 world, and we're going to look at that. We're going to look at the data, look at what we found inside of the, the branch mine. So let's go look at that right now. Okay, so here we are in 1.17.1. Uh, we, uh, again, let's look at the effort, and then we'll look at the data. So uh, the effort is the same. We drop down to Y11. We dug a, a a main trunk of our branch mine. This is the trunk. Now the trunk is off to the side of uh, the the 100 by 100 area, rather than going right down the middle. But it is still calculated within the 100 by 100 area. So uh, I did that just for because right here is 60 on the very edge of this, and so uh, we were able to calculate it. It just did it because it was easier on the uh, x y coordinates. Uh, later efforts, I may just go to zero zero and start um, start doing my branch mine from there. That way we can get a 100 by 100 real easy. And so with that being said, uh, we did do the same exact thing. We did a three by three main trunk. We did a uh, a one by three uh, branches with skipping two blocks in between. With all that said, let's look at the results. The results are in 82 diamond ores, 12 in 12 diamond veins. That is a massive increase. And so that is that is we we collected almost a quarter of that in 1.18. That is that is not a whole lot of diamonds uh in 1.18. And so uh we did we did collect uh in uh, we did collect, collect three additional diamond veins. So even if you took off the three additional di diamond veins, you went to nine diamond ore, you uh you reduced that down by let's say uh, 24 you're still going to have a huge number uh difference in in the diamond ores collected and so the the effort was there in both worlds it's almost identical but in 1.17 diamonds are way easier to find okay so the now we one thing I wanted to talk about while we're still here in the 1.17 world, I found that as I was digging through in the 1.17, and you can see it as we as we just look through here, you see every ore that's available in the world. You see coal, you see redstone, you see gold, you see uh, you see iron, you see uh, lapis. Lapis is down here. Uh, you see every uh, even the the new copper. Uh, blocks are down here and so you see every single uh, ore that's available so let's say you're beginners a beginner in this world you come down here and you start mining 
and you're going to set you up a branch mine and, and start mining out uh, your 100 by 100 area to collect 80 something diamonds which you're not going to you'll mine out just a little bit until you collect as many as you need but uh and then you'll stop and go back up to surface to keep playing the game but with that being said uh you as you mine you're able to come down here let's say you got iron you got all iron gear right now so you got as you mine you collect more iron so that you, as your pickaxes wear out you get more iron pickaxes as your torches run out you get more coal as long as you brought a stack of wood and and some food down here you can stay down here in these mines forever and keep mining uh, uh, all that you want and so um, and collect more and more resources in 1.18 you're gonna have to split your time between this mining level and say a separate mining level that you're going to go up and, and collect more uh, iron and different stuff like that maybe you run across a one of the massive iron veins uh, that you can that you can collect all your iron from but then you're going to drop you're going to go to another level and find some coal and then and then finally you're able to drop down here to the bottom and and get your diamonds and so it's going to make it a lot more difficult um but the question is are they going to nix mining for di for diamonds like this that's the question so and I don't think it has to do with the resources that we're going to collect down here at the uh, at at the bottom of the world. I think the 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 question then becomes uh, where are we going to get our diamonds from? Right now, as it stands in 1.17, it is it, it's a toss up. Do you want to get your diamonds from villagers, or do you want to get your diamonds from the mines? A lot of players, a lot of players just uh, would rather come down here and get all the resources at one time and, and do their mines. A lot of players want to skip the whole mining process altogether, skip that grind. They want to go up and, and, and grind with the villagers, chop down trees, trade sticks, all that there is still a grind. On both sides, it's a grind. But it's, it's almost a split between which is, which is better. And I love that about Minecraft, that both of them are a grind, but both of them uh, give you almost equal reward. That is a, that's a principle of God that we work for what we have. And so um, you can't get nothing for free. We all know that. And so, but let's talk about 1.18. Let's go, let's jump back over there. All right, we are back in the 1.18 world. Now, uh, with all that said about uh, mining and everything in in both worlds, um, there's one uh, part of the equation that we're that we're missing. It's the it's the caves, and so in the 1.17 or 1.18 world, uh, we do see a lot more diamond generation that is ex exposed to air inside of this world you see that one up there that i just went past you see there's one down here next to the lava um, that one and then there's another one right up here next to this lava in that cave and so there's a lot more diamonds exposed uh, to the air inside of the caves and so that will kind of balance it out a little bit the biggest concern that i have with with the the change is is the 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 villagers the villager trading the villager trading will become so much easier than coming down here and branch mining that you know people will opt to they'll come down here they'll explore the caves they'll get them a couple of diamonds so that they set them up an enchanting table uh, but after, outside of that they will not do people's not going to come down here and do branch mining sure they may go up and do a little bit of strip mining you know they find uh, one of the massive uh, the the massive um, ore veins with uh, with iron or copper and they'll they'll you know they'll they're going to strip mine that kind of stuff but they're not going to come down here and, and really search for uh diamonds the way that we have traditionally done in in uh in the branch mines and strip mines and, su and such and so but i'm not i just want you to understand i'm not actually advocating that we put more diamonds down here that's not where I'm going with this. That's not the direction that I would want to see. I don't want to see this right here get so easy down here at the bottom. Um, matter of fact, I would. It, it's it's better that it remain hard. It should be diamonds should be precious. Diamond diamonds are precious in the real world. Diamonds should be precious here. And so uh, I'm not actually advocating that we that we make it easier to get diamonds. What I'm saying is that we have got to do something to make the villager trading harder 
if we're going to make the diamonds harder. Because if we don't make the villager trading harder, everybody's just going to resort re, re, resort to trading with with the villagers, with the exception of some you know massive some multiplayer servers that want to use diamonds for for currency. Other than that, there there's no reason to come down here in the mines. There'd be no reason to come down here in the mines for a single player world. All you would need to do uh, would be to come down into the caves, get you a couple of diamonds, go back up to the surface, and, and trade with uh, uh, trade with villagers for the rest of your diamond gear. And so, and then wait until you get to go to the end, and then you can find you a couple more diamonds and uh, defeat the Ender Dragon, get your elytra, get you a couple more diamonds out in the at the end cities and different stuff stuff like that. So uh, I. I do like the idea of this being a little harder, but it's got to be balanced the same way it's balanced today with the villager trading and the uh, and the diamond mining being almost equivalent. With all that being said, uh, this is actually the third or fourth time I've recorded this. Uh, my, my video capturing software keeps glitching and I don't actually get the uh, the 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 capture so with all that being said i appreciate you watching the video and and i hope this video this right here takes and and i'll get to uh to finish this video out uh all uh, but uh i hope you enjoyed it if you did smash the like button uh consider subscribing and if i don't see you again i hope to see you in heaven